Hey everyone, so instead of the usual walk, I'm going to show you these beautiful white walls because baby, it's cold outside. So recently I've heard a lot about the election of Miss America and essentially her Indian ethnicity and a series of racist remarks against her because of her Indian ethnicity. And I have to say that I felt really angry. Strangely enough, this anger wasn't necessarily because of the racism. Because frankly, racism has become so prevalent that you're kind of desensitized to it. Like you assume someone out there somewhere is going to do something like that. What made me angry was the fact that all these racist remarks were directed against a single person. And I can barely imagine how terrible it would be to wake up after doing something as incredible as becoming Miss America. Well, you know, not me particularly, but like that idea, that same scope of achievement. And just waking up to these, these really hateful remarks for no other reason than the fact that, well, you're not necessarily Caucasian. And when I reflected upon this, I realized really how easy it was to just hate in general. And I don't necessarily mean racism. I mean, like, take... Take a really huge blunder of recent times. Say Rebecca Black's Friday. I mean everyone, everyone pounced on that music video. Everyone slammed on it. And I admit it wasn't great, but there were a lot of people who were just really, really spiteful. And I guess that kind of makes them feel better. The fact that they can kind of release anger that society doesn't really like into, well, against this, this music video. But you have to reflect, though, like, well, what are you doing? I mean, I wonder if those individuals stop for a moment and recognize that they're attacking another human being. That even though what they're doing doesn't require that much energy or dedication or effort or willpower, that the person who will be getting them will probably feel like they've been hit by a sledgehammer repeatedly by millions of people. People who doesn't, who they don't even know. And I would kind of feel like it's not just a person who doesn't like me. It's society who doesn't like me. It's everyone who's devalued me. So that's just kind of my two cents on this entire issue. I do sympathize greatly with her and I hope that well, I guess these stop, but she has my support at least. So thank you everyone.